Greetings people. So I'm going to do another YAS tutorial on how to uh, patch your SUSE machine via SSH. So I already SSH'd into a remote machine and I'm going to show you how to use YAS to view the available patches for your system and then uh, you'll see pretty much what you should expect uh, an unedited version of what you should expect to see when you do the patch use or when you patch your system using YAS. So let's get to it. So whoop, might be nice if I were focused to that window. So in YAS, you want to go to online update. And what I did there is I actually used the arrow keys to move around. So I'm using the arrow keys to go around, press enter. Okay, it's now updating all of the available repositories. Make sure that all the packages and available patch uh, information is available. And there we go. All of the available patches plus uh, you can see, if you can see my cursor, uh, this tells you uh, what the patch does. So, I'm going to press enter for that, press enter for that, that one, OBS tool chain probably not as important on this that particular machine I'll do SSL that is important Firefox gzip utilinux definitely chromium uh, what is this one mount info okay let's say okay for that one another SSL hw info security patch for the Linux kernel, PAM. Wicked, it will be important. Uh, Thunderbird is not used on the machine, so I'm going to avoid that. Ocular is important. Grub, that one, let's make sure zipper is all patched up, GIMP is incredibly useful, uh, so here's the first thing, uh, there's been an issue that you need to manually resolve here. So pressing tab, I have the choice of replace GIMP help browser with a newer version. Uh, point data yada yada point four or 4.4 with uh, yada 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 6.3. So I'm going to tell it to do that. Orbis. What is this? Blue store. I'll avoid that one for now. Kmod. Let's do that. Miranda DB. No, I this, that particular machine does not use a database enough. Doesn't have a running database, so. On a normal uh, normal production server, I'd prefer to have that updated, but it's my mom's machine. <laughs> she doesn't have a database running. System D. Do I need LX terminal updated? I'll do it anyways. Curses definitely.
Okay, so now that I've chosen all of the patches that I'd like uh, installed and implemented on the system, uh, tab, 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 tab. Technically, I could do Alt-A like that, and everything would be done. Okay, so now it's telling me that I will need to reboot the system after doing this security update for the Linux kernel. That is perfectly fine. She'll just be pissed off. Oh no, my computer rebooted on me. You've selected other patches, Willie. Yeah, yeah. Let's go continue. And now this is what you should see. This can take, depending on your internet connection, it can take a long while. It could be stupidly fast. Uh, also depends on what hardware what hardware you have. Are you running an, an IDE hard drive? Are you running a SATA hard drive? A SATA SSD? Uh, SAS drive? Uh, NVMe, all those factors will affect how quickly the process will go. So from here, I will probably try and speed this up. Okay, so it looks like it's just about done. And it's got the kernel that needs to finish up and probably maybe two or three more things. So, it has been about 10, maybe, 15 minutes since we started the uh, patch process. So as I said, uh, it depends on the number of patches available, your internet connection speed, and the speed and efficiency of the drives that you're uh, running off of.
I was absolutely right. Oh, no, I had, there were a lot more than three. Ha! Ah. Well, this one's taking a lot longer than I expected. I didn't think that an ASCII art plugin would take so long. Maybe it's finished, so I'll do that. Or, yeah. I'll do that. Still doing stuff. Okay, let's do that. Had to restart Yast. Now it's making sure all the repos are up to date. And we're done. So I've got only those patches left to do. And as I said earlier, I don't think they're really that massively important. So I thank you for joining me on this and have a wonderful day.